Well, let's try this for the tenth time. I've been trying to make a video of me, voice, my voice, because it's too dark. I have to go out to the rabbit tree tonight because it's um almost six o'clock and it's dark out. So you guys take a look at the picture, and well, it is um almost six o'clock. And well, as of the 27th, Cinder, lay down. Well, as of the 27th of this month, I will be buying myself a Christmas present. And that Christmas present is a female salmon red tail boa constrictor. She's two and a half feet, two feet, two feet long. Probably eating on rat fuzzies and. Rat pup, probably rat pups, probably. I'm gonna switch her to frozen thawed as soon as I get her. <coughs> Gizmo, no. Sorry, that was my puppy. But, um, I'll be switching her to frozen thawed because most red tail boas are garbage disposals, so they'll eat anything. So, but I will be picking up a 29 gallon tank that's. That should last her about a year, and then um, I'll have to fix her another cage. But I'm going to pick her up on the 27th from a guy in Tacoma, probably, hopefully. She's still available, but, um, well, also... I should have a litter of pedigreed father is a sandy pedigreed buck from a strand. The mother is a fawn. Marge, as you guys and guys know, Marge is a fawn though. I bred her to Bart as Homer wasn't ready to breed, so I put her in with Homer, Bart. So we should have, I'm hoping to get fawns, whites, and he's got a little bit of gray, light gray in his background, so we should get grays in his, in the baby litter. I'm hoping she took to the litter as she was trying to, when I put her in with the him, I, they, I, I watched the, her try to ride Bart, which she mean, that means she's ready. So, hopefully she conceived, she's about... A week and a half to two weeks pregnant. Hope, hope bread, hopefully. She is due next month on the 11th. As well as my checkered Flemish cross. She's uh, due the 11th as well. She was bred to my buck jet that I sold. He went to a person that loved Flemish dance. So she had, she had one, but the neighbor's dog got in her yard and killed it. Well, no, no figure, but... But... Mm. I will do an update when I tomorrow. Um, I will be doing another video, uploading another video. Um, well, another video of the rabbits as I did, as I did the this afternoon when I got home, as we got paid today. Well, that's my update. Um, I hope you like it. Okay, well, well, happy Thanksgiving, since I, I won't be on the video until after Thanksgiving, probably. Or I'll do a video of next tomorrow of the rabbit tree. There's really nothing new, but I just like doing the rabbit tree. And, well, there's Gizmo. Gizzy, are you whining? You know you're not supposed to whine, you big puppy dog. She is, um, three-month-old purebred pit bull puppy. She is her daughter. Cinder's being jealous. She wants to go out there and play, but she's too rough with the puppies. Not puppies, but my grandma has a Corgi Welsh Cardigan mix, Basenji mix, and a Pomeranian, Pomeranian, Papillon, Pomeranian Papillon and Bristol Griffon mix. Both of them are nine years old, so 
<laughs> she likes to play. Gizmo, you already been outside. You've been playing. It's night time for you. You can go out again in a while, but I'm doing a video. But there's Mama. She's gained all her weight back, <laughs> and then some. Yeah, she looks sad, but she's tired. She's had a long day today. No, I don't. Cinder. She's going to be fixed here very soon. And you stay off the counter. You know better. She'll be fixed here probably in the next couple of months. I'm going to fix her. As we have a next door neighbor that has a bull mastiff male that I don't want her to breed with. So she's going to be fixed. And you know what? Get Cinder, leave your puppies alone. Leave your baby alone. No, you don't need to be bothering your puppy. But, <laughs> that's where I'm going to be putting my 46 inch TV when I buy it. And then the VCR and my clothes will be going in there underneath the tank. And my Vin Diesel picture that I bought. And one of my grandma's pictures that she did, I'll show you the horses she did. This one, my grandma could. Now, if that isn't something, I don't know what is. <laughs> Here. She, um, painted these. These are all paintings that she did. That she did. A long, long time ago. And there's our old little doggies that we had. One was a Dolby Rottweiler mix. One was a... Probably, I forgot what they call them. Not Border Collie, but, um... What are they called? What are they called? Well, his name was Einstein. He was put down as he was 9 to 10, well, I think he was 11 years old, and he was being bitey and very, very aggressive. So we ended up having to put him down. And, um, Missy, there was a problem with her hips. She broke her hip one time in the car. She fell against the one of the things that we had in the car and broke it. We didn't know she broke her hip, so I didn't realize that we could we could have got help for her at the time we did have her. So we just had to we had her put down to that dog was the shut up, Gizmo. That dog was the best dog in the world. She was a Rottweiler Doby mix. I really miss that dog. She was the best dog we've ever had. So, okay, well, that's the update part video.